Good evening, everybody. This is Sweat, and welcome to the Battlefield 3 uh, public beta, which this is actually the closed beta on Tuesday, September 27th, and this is the uh, the first full game that I participated in after receiving the code in, in via email. And um, what I decided to do is the entire match, the entire round, just the one round, uh, lasted 26 minutes. So I'm going to break it down into a couple segments. Uh, because I personally don't like uh, talking for 23 or 26 or however I just said 26 minutes long at a time. So I'm going to break it up into um, in the segments. Uh, this first one's going to be six minutes. And there's not going to be much editing to this particular clip because I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to be talking about. But uh, but for the following clips, I'm going to try to cut down on some of the, um, on some of the dead time, uh, some of the running around and everything like that. Because to be honest with you guys, I have... Um, and you'll see, I had no idea what I'm doing. I didn't, I didn't get nearly enough prepare for battle done. And you see there, um, I'm sprinting around like it's Call of Duty, and uh, and ran right into this guy who was uh, who was guarding the objective. And I was lucky to have a very, very strong platoon um, whenever I was uh, on my first match because we advanced all the way until the very last objective and ended up losing the round, um, which you'll see at the very end. And um, and I think only one person on the other team outscored me throughout the entire game. But on the next, uh, the following round, which I didn't record because I figured the first one was so long, my computer was already running slow. Um, the following round was over in about 10 minutes, and we uh, we guarded both of the objectives um, without either one of them being lost. So I was I was lucky enough to be on a very very good team. So here you see I'm trying to use the cover to the wall to my advantage, and I start I started to realize that pretty quickly. Um, but what I'm also trying to do is I'm trying to mark targets. And it was really easy on PS3 uh, to mark targets. In fact, you could just go spamming, um, spamming the back button on PS3 and, uh, and mark just about anything. I mean, people you didn't even see. But I guess what they've done is um, a fairly good job of preventing people from doing that. I know there's supposed to be advanced marking system, which, again, I'm not all that aware of. And, uh, and I finally find the use for prone. Uh, in this and then I get blown up by this. What is that? Did I get hit by a grenade or did somebody shoot me? Um, and what you see there that guy doing you'll see a lot of it especially at the beginning But uh, you know, that's what they're supposed to do. They're supposed to be defending the objective So not faulting anybody for being a bush wookie and for hiding in bushes hiding in corners here at the beginning uh, Your goal is to defend that objective and if you would watch <laughs> Luckily, I didn't record it for you guys because basically I sat by a the entire match um, uh, for the next round where we, uh, where we got the win. So I think there I pick up one of my first kills and, uh, and again, I, I make use of cover, make use of prone. And I did a lot of this, uh, throughout the game, which you're going to see, but, um, first, I guess my first impression of this game is I'm really impressed, uh, with not only how it looks, but how it plays. I know a lot of people, um, are putting a lot of stock into, uh, you know, console versus PC and this is a PC only game and everything like that. Uh, you can see the recoil, um, the weapons, the look of the weapons, the look and feel of everything, the environment, and I'm I'm satisfied. Like I really am. I'm I'm happy with it. Um, some of the things, like you see, all right, you know that this is a beta. You see the ground is actually bouncing and uh, bouncing underneath me a little bit, but I'm not gonna put much thought into that. I'm not gonna put much thought into uh, a lot of people claiming about the EA servers. When I first tried to join a game, it did say um, the EA servers were lost. It did take me a few minutes and a few tries to get into a game, um, but that's expected. It's a beta. I think people are being a little too harsh on it, um, especially you know the the fanboys. And let me let me say this. I <laughs> and I, I suffer my first uh, my first knife attack. Uh, I never even heard that guy. But let me go back to real quick. I want to say that uh, I am a Call of Duty fanboy. Uh, that's what I got started in Call of Duty 4 and then Modern Warfare 2 and then Black Ops. I've put in the same amount of time in the Call of Duty series. So um, I'm not comparing these two. I'm not saying that these two are similar games and, you know, you pick one. I I'm really looking forward to playing both of them. Uh, so I just want to throw that out of the way. But I also say that I bought my Astro 840s with this game in mind. Uh, when it came time to buy a new pair of headsets, a new headset. I had it narrowed down to the PX5s, which had the footstep preset. Uh, footstep preset. You see all the assists I get from just spraying randomly right here, uh, which had the footstep presets in it uh, for Call of Duty, and you also had the um, also had these A40s in mind. 
uh, which, I, which I wanted to get for all around sound quality. And when push came to shove, I decided that due to the other games like this, like Battlefield 3, you know, the bigger games with all these extra features in there and all, such a huge emphasis on the environment, um, that I decided to get the A40s uh, just for the experience. And I think it works. I think this game sounds amazing, especially on those headphones, and I think it looks amazing, um, regardless of what anybody says. So, uh, as you watch, and I'm about to completely fail here, I get this kill, and then I get caught up reading the screen. And I'm like, oh, sweet, I got some, oh, shit, there's a guy right there in front of me. <laughs> All right, guys, uh, if you're not subscribed to my channel, I encourage you to do so, especially to check out the next couple episodes of this one match, which, uh, again, was my first match, and I was really happy and pleased with the with the result. I promise you it's a little bit more action than what you see now. And for my subscribers that are watching this video, if you guys could like and maybe even favorite this video, I'd really appreciate it. It would really uh, help me out a great deal. So other than that, guys, look forward to the next episode tomorrow on Wednesday or in the next piece of this match. And hopefully I'll have a lot more to talk about. So uh, you guys have a great day. And thank you again for watching.